Indications for various investigations Outline Microbiological samples Arterial blood gases A, B, G Echocardiography Electrocardiogram E, C, G Microbiological samples Blood culture Indications for taking a blood culture Core temperature out of normal range Focal signs of infection Signs of sepsis Chills or rigors Raised or very low peripheral blood white cell count New or worsening confusion Blood for serology Indications Investigation of bacterial and viral infections for which serological diagnosis is available. Screening to exclude infection or identify existing immunity from past infection or immunization. Body fluids from sterile sites, for example, acetic fluid, bile, synovial fluid. Indications Bacterial infection Fungal infection TB Body fluids Other Example Wound drainage Abscess fluid Indications Bacterial infection Fungal infection TB Feces Indications Investigation of diarrhea Screening of food handlers or special risk groups at discretion of CCDC Helicobacter pylori antigen testing Pus Indications Investigation of suspected infection Scrapings or clippings for mycological investigation. Indications Investigation of suspected dermatophyte infection. Sputum Indications Investigation of suspected bacterial infection. Suspected pneumocystis pneumonia, PCP. Suspected RSV infection. Suspected Legionella infection Swabs Conjunctiva Ear Nose Throat Vaginal Genital Wound or ulcer Indications Investigation of suspected infection Pertussis Pre-nasal swab Indications Suspected whooping cough MRSA screening swabs Indications Exclusion of MRSA carriage Investigation of extent of colonization in known MRSA positive patients as directed by infection control team Meningococcal and diphtheria screening swabs Indications Investigation of possible outbreaks TB culture Indications Investigation of suspected mycobacterial infection T-spot TB assay Indications Diagnosing latent TB infection as well as TB disease. Urine Indications Investigation of suspected urinary tract infection. Arterial blood gases ABGS Indications Respiratory failure in acute and chronic states. Cardiac failure Liver failure Renal failure 
hyperglycemic states associated with diabetes mellitus. Multi-organ failure. Sepsis. Burns. Poisons or toxins. Ventilated patients. Sleep studies. Severely unwell patients from any cause. Affects prognosis. Interpretation of arterial blood gases. Blood pH high indicates alkalosis. Low indicates acidosis. And normal indicates either normal, mixed effect or a compensated defect. PaCO2 level. Is it a respiratory problem? If not, look at the bicarbonate level. High PaCO2 with an acidosis indicates a respiratory problem. If the PaCO2 is normal or low, it indicates compensation. Bicarbonate. If the bicarbonate fits with the pH, it suggests a primary metabolic problem. If not, it indicates compensatory changes. Look for any compensation. Example, low PaCO2 in severe metabolic acidosis. An iron gap in metabolic acidosis. See below under other useful information from arterial blood gases. Oxygen level. Is hypoxemia present? Echocardiography. Indications. Heart murmurs. Native valvular stenosis. Native valvular regurgitation. Prosthetic valve assessment. Infective endocarditis. Ischemic heart disease. Cardiomyopathy. Pericardial disease. Cardiac masses. Echocardiography before cardioversion. Hypertension. Aortic and major arterial disease. Preoperative echocardiography for elective and semi urgent surgery. Pulmonary disease. Neurological disease. Arrhythmia. Palpitations and syncope. Cardiac tamponade. Aortic valve abnormalities. Mitral valve problems. Pericarditis. Cardiogenic shock. Pulmonary hypertension. Blood clots within the heart. Defects in the heart muscle walls. Electrocardiogram. ECG. Indications. Patients with implanted defibrillators and pacemakers. Myocardial injury and ischemia. Ischemic coronary disease. Evaluation of metabolic disorders. Effects and side effects of pharmacotherapy. Evaluation of primary and secondary cardiomyopathic processes among others.